And now it's time for Tiki Hut. Over to you, Carly. The Mai Tai is the classic tropical cocktail. All self-respecting tiki bars will have it on their drinks menu. The crucial ingredient is rum. Light or dark will do, but I prefer dark. Firstly, toss three shots into your shaker. Rum comes from sugarcane, which is why it's known as the spirit of the islands. Oh yeah. Mai Tais are traditionally made with lime juice, but I prefer a pine orange flavor. So, if you're like me, add one shot of pineapple juice, and one shot of orange juice. Hmm, vitamin C. Debate still surrounds the origin of the Mai Tai. Many historians insist it was invented by Victor Bergeron, founder of the Polynesian-themed Trader Vic's Cocktail Lounge in 1944 in Oakland, California. Others contend it was created by a rival of Vic's, Don the Beachcomber, at his flagship Hollywood bar in 1933. Both Don, aka Ernie Gant, and Vic enjoyed huge success during the tiki fad of the 1950s. The Luau Party derives from the Polynesian feasts of the Far Islands of the Pacific. Trader Vic's continued to flourish, today boasting over 24 bars around the world. Unfortunately, Don the Beachcomber's franchise floundered during a messy divorce for Gant. Mixologists are still at odds as to which of these two pioneers created the tiki movement's most popular tipple. There are rules about which spirit she can shake and which one she can't. Rum's pretty tough. It's like vodka. It won't bruise. So once you've added the ice, feel free to shake away. Once your cocktail shake is cold enough, pour your Mai Tai into cocktail glass. Some mixologists maintain holding the cocktail glass at a slight angle reduces oversplash. So add some more ice. And for a zing, a dash of grenadine. This creates the classic sunset effect. Garnish with a maraschino cherry. And it's ready to go. Translated from Tahitian, Mai Tai means out of this world. And that's exactly how you'll feel after a few sips. But remember, always drink sensibly. The Mai Tai. Let's review. That's three parts rum, yeah. one part orange juice, one part pineapple juice, and a dash of grenadine. If you enjoyed today's episode, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you next time.